Hey guys, uh, I ran into some issues with the uh, turn signals um, when I was installing the the LED uh, sequential tail lights. So I started messing with the steering wheel to look into it, see what was the problem. Uh, this is a 62 Impala. In order to remove the steering wheel, there is there's two screws here. Right here. See, there's one right there and one on the opposite end. Um, in my case, they were just Phillips. So I went ahead and took them off already, which then this pops out. See how they actually screw onto here and here. So now uh, we remove the steering wheel, which to remove the steering wheel in this case is just a three quarter inch uh, nut there in the center. And I already broke it loose, so I'll just take it off. Just run, run with you guys. Alright, it's off. The steering wheel comes off. Uh, maybe it all depends. I think this one had already been removed previously, so um, that's why it wasn't so hard to, to remove. Take this mask off here. And uh, there's actually a canceling cam right here, which I replaced already. See this old one. I don't, I didn't see anything wrong with it. Just, but I just swapped it out since I already had it. And uh, it was just, it consisted of two screws, two Phillips screws on there. If you guys can see them there, right there. And. That's that. And then, so the, the problem I actually ran into was here inside. Here, let me pull it off. This is the whole uh, turn signal assembly. This little rod just screw, un unscrews, and if it's tight on there, so you could actually put a, a wrench on there or uh, a crescent just to break it loose, take it off. And then it's got that uh, flat head. Take it off. It's a bit hard. Hey, come, come here, Ben. I'm gonna get us. So I'm gonna hold the camera for him. Have a hard time. So you move the screw off there. And the whole assembly comes off. See. Hold it right there. this comes off and the issue I was having was right in here this well this little pin is supposed to go in there that little pin see how right there sits in there so what mine was doing it would get stuck to the right side and it would never move why because this wasn't in there sitting in there to bring it back over let's see so now that was the issue and i was going to replace this whole piece but i mean it, it looks like they replaced it they just didn't install it properly let's see all right putting it back on there with that little pin sitting in there you see your bolt back in and whenever you tighten it back down do not tighten all the way I actually think there should be a washer there but I just don't see it to help it prevent um, from us, even if you tighten it all the way, you still got that little gap. But 
everything just nice and snug. That's it. And you put the little arm back on there. There it goes. Turn it up. All right. Guess that. See, it's on. It's right. There it goes. Left. There it goes. See, mine would actually stay stuck this way. See, it, it couldn't come back, so. We'll go, see how it sits. This is how it works in there. Do my lighting stack good. everything back on stream one straight right there that yeah come back and tighten it up right before I, uh, put that other trim back on